For many, gardening is a passion that also takes a lot of time. Oh, it depends. Sometimes all day, sometimes an hour to a day. But marathon yard work can turn into an injury if you're not careful. Oh, once I stepped in a hole. <laughs> I was planting a herb. I was planting a, a hedge. And yeah, I had a lot of trouble with my leg after that. Because I wasn't listening to the pain that I had and stopping. So I have mechanical back error. It's not uncommon for people to hurt themselves while gardening. In fact, spring is one of the busiest times of years for chiropractors for that exact reason. Because so many people have been sedentary, not doing much activity during the winter months and then May 24th hits and everybody has to do 10 hours of gardening and uh, they're sore afterward. Dr. Overton says more serious injuries usually caused by lifting need to be treated. When your spine's not functioning well it interferes with the nervous system and throws the nervous system off balance. Now in the long term what that can do even if you're not getting any pain is it sends negative information to the brain which puts your brain into in your body into a fight or flight stress response. So it's key if you're going to get out and garden to follow some simple tips, especially when lifting sod, mulch or heavy plants. And then you want to keep your back nice and straight and bend with the knees and slowly pick up the load, get a feel for how heavy it is and then pick it up gently like that. Because no one wants to hurt themselves right before the summer season gets underway. Celine Moreau, CTV News.